It's over one year now that uh, WHO and partners have been helping Ukraine and to be specific Zakarpatia to respond to the outbreak of uh, polio uh, mellitus. Polio mellitus is a disease that is targeted for eradication and one confirmed case is an outbreak. Zakarpatia is so unique because it's in the western part of Ukraine and it has about four international borders. What WHO did is to identify some marginalized community and then by constant community engagement so as to raise awareness about the disease. І на сьогодні так дійсно є позитивні зрушення, що е, релігійні чи інші е, там керівники територіальних громад це ті партнери, яких яких можна подзвонити, написати, запитати, як бути краще, як робити. Most of the target age group goes to school, so we've invited their teachers, we have taught them what they will notice in children, and also if they identify those cases, they quickly send them to the hospital. WHO has supported Ukraine to build the capacity of its healthcare workers. Це дуже важливо. Також проводилося офлайн навчання не тільки наших епідеміологів, але і лікарів первинної ланки, лікарів різних спеціальностей, освітян, що дало нам можливість на одній мові розмовляти. We help to establish environmental surveillance for polio virus to identify some sewage plants and then the individuals were also trained to be able to collect samples and then take them to the lab. The laboratory staff were also trained on how to be able to identify this polio virus. There's been a sustained support by partners in providing all the necessary technical support and also providing supplies to the regional CDC to be able to be self-sustaining. Отримали автобус, завдяки якому, завдяки якому ми зможемо приїжджати до населення, щоб максимально наблизити вакцинацію. It's over one year now there is no case of polio that had been confirmed. Ukrainians were able to show this level of uh, resilience. They were able to stand very strong, manage it well to be able to respond to this tragic situation of outbreak and also the war. Надіємося, що ми далі будемо це застосовувати свої знання не тільки для поліоміліту, у нас є багато викликів. Тому ми готуємося. Ми готуємося і ми завжди готові.